Now to more developing news. A Springfield police officer is healing at home after uh, police say a man tried to kill him last night. Investigators tell Western Mass News Officer Greg Vitrano was stabbed in his uniform's trauma plate while pursuing a suspect. Western Mass News reporter Audrey Russo live from our downtown MGM studios with more on Officer Vitrano and the device that saved his life. Audrey? Police say Officer Greg Vitrano was running after Ruben Barrero Jr. when all of a sudden Barrero turned around and aimed straight for Officer Vitrano's heart with a kitchen knife. They say the only thing preventing that blade from piercing Vitrano's skin was a small plate embedded in the vest that all police officers wear on the job. Bulletproof vests often dominate the conversation on police officer attire. But Springfield police say this trauma plate, worn over the chest, can stop a blade. And Wednesday night, they say it saved Officer Greg Vetrano from serious injury. Actually struck the trauma plate of his bulletproof vest, ripped his shirt, and, and hit the trauma plate, and we recovered the kitchen knife. Springfield police officers must wear their ballistic vests if they're going out in the street on duty, and on the vest in the center is a steel plate called a trauma plate, covers your heart area. The trauma plate is worn underneath the officer's uniform, and police say it would not have been visible to Ruben Barrero Jr. But Clapperud says Barrero didn't stop when his first attempt on Vetrano's life was unsuccessful. He was delivering blows to the officer's head and body. The taser was deployed on Mr. Barrero and was ineffective. Officer Vetrano was suffering from a broken hand and cuts and bruises. How long is Officer Vetrano expected to be out of work? With the broken hand, he's going to go uh, week to week with me. Um, I, we're kind of guessing at the start, maybe six weeks. Springfield Mayor Dominic Sarno spoke at a press briefing, offering his support for the four-year veteran of the force. I spoke with uh, Officer Vetrano very early uh, uh, this morning. He's looking to get back on ASAP. This case strikes close to the heart for Sarno as well. This is a, a family member, a cousin, and this shows uh, uh, the dangerousness of what our men and women go through. Vetrano's brother, Frank Vetrano, is a professional hockey player. He used to play with the Boston Bruins, now plays with the Florida Panthers. We're told Officer Greg is recovering at home this evening. Now, when it comes to Ruben Barrero Jr., the suspect in this case, he's facing a litany of charges, the most serious being armed assault with a, an attempt to murder. We'll have more on his criminal background on our website, westernmassnews.com. Reporting live in Springfield, Audrey Russo for Western Mass News.